Hi, my name is Diana, and today I am in Bellevue, one of the hottest and fastest growing cities in the greater Seattle area. Today I'm gonna to be showing you restaurants, bars, shopping, and just general things to do in the area. One of the reasons Bellevue is so popular is because companies like Amazon and Facebook have moved in downtown and there's many more companies that are coming in. So this place is really great for tech families. Another reason why so many families choose to call Bellevue their home is because Bellevue has some of the best rated schools in the entire state. Bellevue is also centrally located. You're just a short drive from Seattle, Redmond where Microsoft is and Kirkland. So really you're in the middle of it all. Right now we're at Maiden Bower Park, which is really close to downtown Bellevue. This place is really never that packed, but it is absolutely stunning. Great place to go if you're looking for a waterfront in Bellevue. If you're looking to move to Bellevue, there are lots of amazing neighborhoods to choose from, especially of things like safety, great schools, and close proximity to other big cities is a priority to you. Bellevue is definitely the place. Restaurants, where do I even begin? Bellevue has so many. Let me just share some of my favorites with you. If you're really craving sushi and you want some good ambiance, definitely check out Hapanessa. My personal recommendation is to go during happy hour. You're gonna get great sushi, great atmosphere, and you're not gonna have to fork out a bunch of money for it. Now, if you're a little bit on the hungrier side, I would definitely go to Fogo de Chao where you can get all you can eat steak and a huge salad bar. Now, I won't be able to show you all of my favorite restaurants today, but there is one in particular that I definitely wanna show you guys, and that's gonna be Ascend, which is a steak and sushi place, and they've also got some really great happy hour, and I'm not even gonna mention the views. You'll have to see for yourself. So now we are at Ascend, one of my favorite places ever for the best view in Bellevue. I think that the view really speaks for itself. You get to see Lake Washington, look over the city. It is absolutely gorgeous. So we got probably the fanciest fries ever. They're called the Nori Malt Vinegar Dusted Fries with truffle aioli. So good. Next, we got sushi tacos made with tuna and togiko. Just a look at how good those look. Okay, so they brought out the 1921. Um, obviously, very cool drink. I got a little bit too excited and started drinking it before we started filming. Um, so here you are. And here we've got the Wagyu Beef Cheap Bao Sliders. I think that might be the longest name ever. Um, so that's how you know that it's probably really good, right? Oh yeah, that's like my new phrase or whatever. I just say, oh yeah. <laughs> I ain't felt this good in a minute. Only I ain't trying to rent it. Okay, so we are at Civil Tea and Unrest. I think I said that the right way. Um, it's supposed to be a speakeasy in the Lincoln Square Towers in Bellevue. Um, it's not that secretive, um, but the ambiance here is definitely pretty cool. And I actually just got this really good drink. It's called Papa Nasty. Yeah, uh, well, it's not nasty as the name might suggest. <laughs> it's actually really good. It's got a lot of flavor. Uh, so yeah, if you're just looking for kind of like a more low key, but really fun place to check out, this is definitely it.
After our drinks, uh, the owner Joe of Civil Civility and Unrest, I got the name wrong the first time, actually decided to take us to the back to the part where no one else really is. There's actually two sides to this bar. All sorts of really cool stuff, like his liquid nitrogen tank, which was pretty crazy. Uh, and then he also told us that this was rated actually the best bar in Bellevue this year. And then uh, that he got an award for uh, up and rising, what is it? Up and rising chef. <laughs> so obviously this place is really cool. They're always coming up with different kinds of cocktails different little things that they're putting together to make a really unique experience. If you're going to be in Bellevue, you definitely need to check this out. Guys, that's all for today's video. Those are some of my favorite things to do in Bellevue. Um, however, if you're actually thinking of moving to the area and you're not really sure about which neighborhood and you want to learn more about Bellevue, definitely reach out. I am happy to connect and share more.